Uh, I'm Andy King, and I have taught at Stevenson for more than 20 years. And thank you for your attendance. It's great to be back. Our first inductee, well, how do you turn a basketball program into one of the state's winningest for over 23 consecutive seasons? Fierce defense and strategic offense. And of course, that's the approach our first inductee takes towards his team's gym space. Fierce defense, strategic offense. Welcome, Pat Ambrose. Thank you very much, Andy. I appreciate it. Uh, I just got a longer list of thank you and just a couple uh, thoughts to share with everyone. Uh, again, I would like to thank the committee for uh, its uh, great honor. I have an attitude of gratitude for Trish Beto. We talked about it. Uh, it's uh, quite uh, humbling for me to be up here in front of all these people and that, uh, all the accomplishments. Uh, I'd also like to give congratulations to all those members that are being inducted with me today and the past members. Um, I remember two years ago, and when Andy was talking about with Frank Petucci, it was quite uh, quite amazing to see that the Hall of Fame get off the ground then and, and uh, as it continues, it's wonderful. Okay? I'd also like to uh, say thank you very much to my socialist colleagues that are here uh, supporting me as well. That's uh, great. Uh, but the first thing I would start out, obviously, uh, or, or most importantly, is my family. My wife, Tracy, my sons, Evan and Matthew, are here supporting me, and that's, uh, that means a lot to me. Uh, we have quite a few administrators here that have supported me over the years. Uh, Trish Bedhauser has uh, been fantastic to me. Mike Fay was on my staff as well, too. So uh, they're... Uh, they're a big part of my uh, journey here to get up here. Uh, I'd also like to share a little story. Uh, Dr. DeFore, who we're honoring today, uh, was the superintendent that took a chance on a young coach myself years ago, Joel Finfer, uh, and also John Martin uh, was another person uh, that was sitting across the interview table from me years ago, and I was, boy, was I nervous. Uh, and they, I think they just shook their heads. I think this guy's got maybe a chance, maybe a chance it might be okay. Uh, let's give him a chance. Let me chance. So it's uh, really neat for me today to have Dr. DeFore and uh, John Martin also be in, uh, inducted today on such a great day. I, of course, want to also uh, thank all my assistant coaches over the year, and uh, I think you probably know the one I'm going to thank the most, uh, Paul Swan. He has been with me every step of the way, and uh, he is uh, my right hand man and, and also in the Hall of Fame. And uh, he, he really has uh, been my guiding light for me over the years as an assistant coach. Uh, others, Coach uh, Pearl, Coach Swan, Coach Taylor, as I said, Coach Fay, have really uh, uh, made my job a whole lot easier. Uh, players, of course, uh, I've had some pretty good ones. You've heard of them. Uh, uh, and uh, they really have made my job uh, much easier uh, just to kind of let them go, let them play. I'd also like to thank my mentors, uh, my high school basketball coach, uh, uh, Dick Whitaker, was one that really got me into coaching and got me into uh, kind of teaching. Uh, he died several years ago, and so uh, every time I have any moment like this, I, I, I take a, uh, you know, definitely a time to, to thank him. Uh, I've had some other great mentors in college and uh, high school. Uh, coaching stops along the way, Coach Wandro, Coach Schneider, um, I, I, none of you know them, but I always have to say them because they, they mean a lot to me. Um, the last thing I'd like to say is that, uh, you know, the recipe uh, for being successful here at Stevenson really is, uh, is a teamwork. And I, I really uh, take that seriously because um, uh, it's, a, it's a team game, basketball is. And we play both offense and defense, and we uh, really kind of pull for each other and developing uh, young men and molding young men of character uh, is really one of my main goals every year. And uh, that is kind of, you know, pushed me along in my career and uh, made me kind of the person that I am today. So in conclusion, and again, I'd really like to thank everyone, thank the committee, thank uh, everyone here today, and I'm uh, very grateful and humble. Thank you.